What's going on everyone? This is Vince from Life with Vince Lou. Today is a new day and today I feel like doing some deadlifts. Time to go crush it. And there it is, barbell conventional deadlifts, working sets of 345, three by three. And I know my form was starting to give out just a little bit with each passing set, but also each passing rep within the set. Though, I am still super happy that I was able to keep a lot of my strength since I haven't really deadlifted in five or six weeks. And I know a lot of you might ask why I'm not wearing a belt. Honestly, the belt is really uncomfortable for me. I feel like it just gets in the way and I really haven't worn a belt in five or six years. The only time that I really wear a belt is when I'm testing my one rep max. Out of the last five or six years, I've probably worn a belt less than 10 times. So that's just the way I do it, just the way I like it. And with the deadlifts, I just feel like it builds my lower back a lot better and I'm able to build a stronger lower back without the belt. Whoops, almost forgot about my squats. One set of 20, that's good enough. Squat, every day May, day four. It's that time of the day again. Time to go on my run. I can feel it. It's gonna be a good one. Whoo, good run. Easy four miles around the lake by my house, my normal loop. Felt good, I wanted to go a little bit longer, but I'm gonna save my legs for tomorrow, and I did lift it today. Tomorrow I'm gonna go for a medium run, gonna go for seven, eight miles, and we'll see for the rest of the week, because on Friday I will be doing the burn 10K in a day challenge, and I'll be starting at Friday at 12 a.m., and then I'll have 24 hours to burn 10k calories so we'll see how that goes and i actually wanted to answer a question that i got a request from on instagram and then i've had a couple of people ask me on youtube as well is how i stay motivated and for me personally i just think about the life that i want the person that i want to be and as cliche as that sounds that's what gets me up in the morning because I want to be successful, I'm not only in fitness, and I'm super motivated in fitness, and fitness keeps me grounded, but this is just from a big picture of what I want in life. And I know to get to my goals of what I want in life, because I want to be successful, and I want to have money, and I want to be surrounded by the right people, I want to have a loving relationship, and there's these things that I want out of life. And I know to get there that I'm gonna have to put in the goals day in and day out. And I use that metaphor in all areas of life that I wanna better, and especially fitness, because if I want to finish that ultra marathon, if I wanna get a black belt in Jiu Jitsu, if I wanna get super strong in powerlifting, aesthetics, in bodybuilding. If I wanna get all that, I know that I have to put in the work day in and day out. And I know that if I, if I skip a day, that's one day less that, that that one day is gonna hold me back. And that means that I have to put in work, not literally every waking moment, but whenever I get the chance, I have to put in work. So I don't mind feeling sore. I don't mind feeling like dog poop because that's how it's supposed to feel. That, that's how it's supposed to feel in all areas of your life. You're supposed to be tired. You're supposed to hurt. You're supposed to be exhausted and you have to be smart with your training. You have to be smart with how you approach your goals. And this is how I try to approach each and every one of my goals, not just fitness, but making money and relationships and whatever goals that I want to better. And this is for me personally. Hey, how's it going? So you can just leave that there. Thank you. 
Yeah, of course. Thanks, you too. I think we got an Amazon package. I was on a roll. <laughs> Hopefully I can pick up where I left off. Yeah, so for me, and this is for me personally, it's not for anyone else. And I think, you know, it's, 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 it's just what I ask myself. And I ask myself how, how bad I want it. And for me, I want it, I want it bad. And I want to get to my goals. I want to be successful, I want to be rich. I want to have nice things. I want to have, it's not even necessarily nice things, it's the freedom that money buys. It's the, the reaching that 100 mile mark, 100, crossing that finish line, getting my black belt in Jiu Jitsu, getting super strong, and getting to those goals that I set out for. And I think about that, and that's what gets me motivated, that's what gets me up in the morning. Because once you realize that you have to put in work, for a meaningful time and not just a day, not just a week. You have to put in work years. And it might not be a year, not might, it might not be two years. It might be five, it might be 10. Everybody has a different timeline. But I know that I, if I put in work day in, day out, and if I am smart with my goals, that I'm gonna get pretty far. And there's no way that I won't succeed if I, if I put in work, like truly put in work, and the, the only person that knows that I'm putting in work is me. So you have to ask yourself, or, you know, this is, again, this is just my personal belief and my personal opinion, and it's just how I think about it myself, because I truly know what I can put in and what I did put in, because in a year from now or in five years from now, I know that, oh, that, would, that was one day that I took off or that was one day that I took off, or that was one cheat meal that I had, or that, and, and don't get me wrong, I still have cheat meals, but not necessarily cheat meals because I track my macros, but I, I still have days where I don't do much, but it's gotten better, you know, and it's, for me, it's, it's, you know, one, one, every action that, your life right now is a culmination of all the actions that you've taken, all, all everything that you've done, that nap that you decided to do, that hour that you decided to put in towards your goals. And I'm happy with where I'm at right now because of that, of the culmination of, of all my actions. But I want certain things out of my life. So I know that five years from now, 10 years from now, I'm gonna thank myself because I will put in meaningful time and meaningful strides towards my goals. So I hope that kind of gave you all a little bit of insight. I kind of just ranting right now and Again, this is all me, this is all my personal belief. And this is how I like to approach my goals. At times, I'm extreme for sure. But that's just how I am, because I, I want it, and I want it bad. And I'm not gonna have anything or anybody stop me, and this is how I am. And you know, it's, you just have to ask yourself what you want out of life and what you're willing to put in. Yeah, so. Thanks for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed that video. Hoping y'all enjoyed that day. Another day of lifting, another day of running. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Please give this video a thumbs up. It really help me out. All right, see you tomorrow.